Hello everyone, it's Po Dan Sada here. Welcome back to our educational video series. And today we walk into how to join nomination pools of Polkadot Network. Let's check it out. But first, what are nomination pools and why do we need to do it? Well, nomination pools are a new feature for Polkadot staking system that allows users to pull their DOT tokens together on chain to nominate validators and receive rewards. Nomination pools are one of the key features for the roadmap of staking improvements on Polkadot, and they are designed to permissionlessly allow members to pull their funds together and act as a single nominator account. More significantly, one of the most impactful effects of users joining nomination pools is that it will help secure the network by becoming more and more decentralized. This will evolve the action of choosing the reliable validators just like the evolutionary event of the merge when Ethereum moved from proof of work to proof of stake. Not only that, this staking process will help Polkadot improve the system scalability and the network sustainability. Moreover, there are some points that we should be clear from the very beginning. Firstly, please remember that an account can only be a member of a pool at the time. And secondly, we can only participate in a pool with a transferable balance and the amount we participate with is transferred from our account to the nomination pool. And this pool account is controlled by mathematical logic, not any centralized parties. Another thing that must be taken into account is that we must carefully choose the nomination pools because if we want to exit that nomination pool, then we'll be entitled to an about period where our state token must take 28 days on Polkadot and 7 days on Kusama to unstake. So, please consider it carefully for our fund. Finally, the current minimum bond to join a pool on Polkadot is 1 dot, and that is enough for our receive staking rewards. Alright, and that is done for the knowledge side that we have to prepare before experiencing the practical steps of joining a pool. Now first, let's get access to a Polkadot or Substrate portal. We'll provide a link in the description below, and it will look just like this. The platform will ask us to connect to one of the existing wallets extension, and there are several supported wallets like Talisman, SubWallet, Fields Wallet, and Polkadot.js. And in this tutorial, we'll use SubWallet. Once connected our wallet to the platform, it will automatically identify our wallets and choose the proper network and RBC node to connect. And if we want to stake on a different chain, we can click on the Polkadot logo on the left of the account type and we are free to customize our network. We can test on different test networks like West End, which is a Polkadot and Kusama test network that enables us to perform actions and tutorials just like the main name Polkadot or Kusama. Let's get back to the flow of finding pools. Look at the top bar and click on the Network tab, then choose Pool Sections. This is where we choose pools to join and bond our DOT tokens or simply stake it. Next, we click on All Pools. Before joining a pool, we already know that the unbound period is long and can take up to 28 days in Polkadot. Therefore, we must choose nomination pools really, really carefully. Okay, so looking at a list of pools, there are many information like the state of the pool, staking points, claimable dot, nominees, and members. We can even click on the button that looks like a below symbol. We can see here we have information of nominator, creator of the pools, and a stash and rewards account for us to take on. Okay, that is done for the research part. Now we want to join the nomination pools that we like. And in this video, we choose Subwallet Official Pools by clicking the Join button and the pop-up will appear just like this. The information requires the account that we join the pool and the amount of DOT tokens which is initial value to assign to the pool. The minimum for staking is 1 DOT in order for us to claim rewards. Then we just click Join and an authorized transaction will pop up to provide us with the information relating to fees and other calculations for us to confirm again and sign. And done, a notification badge will appear to inform us about the success of our joining action. Now it is the claiming rewards part. Let's switch to another page for better observation. We we'll provide a link below, it can be manually typed like this. The overview of the website looks like this, we need to go for the pools tab. And here we can see the option pools information very easily such as we are a member of what pool, who are the nominators, the mean of max amount of dot required, what is our bonus status, and what is the pool status. 
If it is in the nominating and earning words, that means the pool is doing great. We can even leave the pool by clicking on the pink leaf button next to member what pool section and we need to be through the unbonding period. And if we are still a member of the pool, then claim rewards tab is where we can claim our reward manually with the withdraw button to receive staking rewards or we can choose a bond button to auto compound staking rewards to receive more tokens. And that's the video about joining nomination pools of Polkadot. If you really enjoyed the video, do not forget to like, share, and subscribe to Polkadot Insider for more insightful videos. Bye, see you next time.